Okay, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? Okay, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? We um over here live over on the Facebook side of shit, but we're gonna share this with the YouTube family and let the YouTube family see how I'm doing over here with the Facebook shit. And you know, I'm gonna drop this shit as well on YouTube and do some live shit over on YouTube as well. So, ladies and gentlemen, on the phone with me right now, I have no other, none other than Miss Sarah Washington, the sister of Hussein Fado. What's up, baby? How you feeling? I'm great. You great? Uh oh, is you breaking up on us? The phone breaking up? You know what? It is my phone. <laughs> it is my phone. The devil is busy. The devil busy. Okay. So, you know it. So, uh, what what's going on? What made you decide to call in? You see me over here live. What made you decide to call in? <clears throat> so you know what? Because I haven't been on my job. I haven't checked on you all year, mm -hmm. and I see you've been doing the live podcast, and I'm actually up. Mm -hmm. So I said, let me holler. Um, aside from that, I got some things on my mind. I did a um, another live earlier today, mm -hmm. and I guess I was just flowing with it. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and I got something on my heart. I got a lot of things on my heart that I need to share, but, you know, you got to get the, the right crowd and the right people to understand okay. before you go further. Mm -hmm. And um topic that's on my heart is saving our people. Well, you know what? I'm about saving our people, but here's the real question. Do our people want to be saved, Sarah? Do they want to be saved? We can't save people that don't want to be saved, right or wrong. You're right. Okay. You're right. But then you have to go a little further and, and ask, do they want to be saved from what? Mm -hmm. They don't even know what the hell is going on for them to be saved. You got damn right. They don't want us. That's, that's the fuckery going on. See, let me tell you this. Right. And, and um... People, men, my young brothers, my thing is this, and I'm going to give you an ounce of game for free, okay? A man who follows another man ain't a leader. And God damn it, I'm a leader. And, w and when I say that is, let's, let's, let's clear this up because I don't want nobody to, to take it in the wrong matter, right? So the thing of what I'm saying is, okay, if I believe something, right, and that's my total belief, and somebody else over here mm -hmm. believes in something else, and then I drop my beliefs and follow this man's belief or this woman's beliefs, well, we, like I said, not woman's, but man's belief, then that makes me a fucking follower. Right. A, a motherfucker that don't have a mind of my own. So that's, that's, that's the first step. For us saving ourselves of learning how to lead. I'm a born goddamn leader. You see, I, I lead the crowd. I move the crowd. That's what we do over here. Detroit shit. Right. The first thing we need to do is acknowledge our place. Yes, we do. Who we are, what we are, and what role we play in the universe. Mm -hmm. Now, just to drop some jewels. Drop them. Um, and I'm putting quotes, quotations up. Mm -hmm. The man is supposed to be head of household. Facts. Keyword, supposed to. Mm -hmm. Not true. Right. The woman is head of household. The woman is head of life. The woman gives you life. Mm -hmm. So one woman is equivalent. One woman is equivalent to two men are equivalent to one woman. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. To one woman. So... When we start respecting the 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 person, the very being that gives us life, mm -hmm. only then can we start respecting ourselves. Facts. If we choose not to acknowledge or put them below, it won't happen. Because what our people fail to realize, as above, so below. Mm -hmm. And they equate that to, to, to spooky shit. And it's not. It is your heritage. It is within you. A lot of people live for the flesh. You are real. But your body is your body. It's real's body. You understand what I'm saying? I understand. The shit I understand that you want to kick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. So the shit that you want to kick and the shit that we want to put out here is supposed to heal real, not real's body. Or uh, should I go there? Uh, well, well, hold on. Like my man Chris. Body. Hold on, my man Chris. LaRon Orr just said, without the seed of a man, is nothing. 
There's nothing without us. Every man should be his own man, period. That's what Paris Williams just said. Every man should be his own man? Mm Mm-hmm. How so? When you come from woman. You come from woman, but guess what? We come in woman. So we come in woman... Come on, he got to bring you shout out, Rug. <laughs> See, that's what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> Y'all not ready to hear me. <laughs> well, well, come on. Now, now. if you want to take it there, yeah. I hold on, Rug. Well, if you want to say a male comes in woman. Mm hmm. Millions of years ago, we didn't need y'all to do that because that little thing that a woman has called a clitoris mm-hmm. was actually used to in, to to fertilize our own selves. So we didn't need mm-hmm. a man to come. In. Well, well, technically, y'all playing with y'all on clitoris is that that ain't no good. Come on, let's quit playing, Sarah. Why should you quit playing with yourself, now? Literally, quit that shit. I speak facts, man. You speak facts. So you tell I see you on your joking shit. So, it is all good. So what you tell so what you saying right now to the three one three live show family, everybody that's in this motherfucker right now, you're saying you don't need no man. No. No. I didn't see that. Okay. We need balance. We, yeah, we need balance. And with a woman has to come a man. Yes. So you, you need that balance. I'm not saying that women don't need men. Mm-hmm. You're here for strength. Mm-hmm. You're, you're here to work, so we do need you. Most but we don't need you in the, the catastrophic state that y'all are in now. You're no good to us. Well, listen, I'm a strong motherfucking man, so I'm needed. My breed of men, we are needed. We are <laughs> fucking warriors. We we stand on our own. We get it. We don't, we don't that, beg for that's shit. That's what the protection is. That's what the protection is here for. That's what the strength is here for. You are warriors, but can I ask you this? Sure. Ask are you ready to bow down to any black woman? What did you just say? Am I ready to bow down to any black to woman? To bow down to any black woman. Yes. Are you ready to bow down to any black woman? That ain't how that shit goes, Sarah. Now, you got to quit that shit. What you had to drink. Now, it's supposed to be y'all bowing on us. See, that's, that's the thing that, that's, 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 <laughs> all right, Ralph, that's what y'all think. That's what, that's what y'all think. Okay. That's, that's not so. Because mm-hmm. without woman, there would not be life. Mm-hmm. Did you hear what I said in the right. beginning? Mm-hmm. Without Mary, let me take it in European terms take, and then take it back to Africa. Break it, break it. Without Mary, mm-hmm. a.k.a. Isis, mm-hmm. there will be no Jesus, a.k.a. Haru, a.k.a. Ra. Mm-hmm. You feel where I'm going with it? I'm going, I see exactly what So you're why going. should we, if we are the giver of life, or we, we are the divine feminine energy, if we are the giver of life, mm-hmm. how then can we bow down to a man? We pick our king. Now, I'm, I'm gonna, Our kings don't choose us. I'm going to roll with what Corey Wilson just said. How can the head bow down to a woman? I, I'm with him on that. How? 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 Okay, so we can go there. We can talk about the unk. Let's talk about it. What is the unk? What is the unk? The unk is the representation of life, okay. the Holy Trinity, okay. which in the church they have you believe in is the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, Fact. which is absolutely wrong. Okay. It is the father, the mother, and child. Okay. That is what the unk is that hoop, correct? Okay. I'm to here. the left and right, mm-hmm. The le- to the left and right are the arms, which are the children. Mm-hmm. And at the bottom, that represents the man, the penis. Okay. Did you hear what I said? Represent- at the bottom. <laughs> right. Okay. Right. Right. So we, we want to talk about it. We can take it to Kemet, Let's take which it is there. ancient Egypt. Take- that's, that's, that's what they say. That's what the um, represents. Mm-hmm. Now, it's, it's more that it represents, and I'm not that far in my studies to go there and be accurate, but it's more to that. But you have to be on a certain playing field to even even grasp that. Okay. But women are the creator of life. Isis created Ra. Ra gives us life. He is the sun god. Okay. He gives us what we need. We are connected to Ra by way of melanin or carbon. Okay. I'm Without... Isis, there will be no Ra. Mm-hmm. 